and sensuality to the clothes this season, I think. And it was inspired very much by a girl who was, a young girl who was discovering, discovering her womanhood. Um, and also delving into the, the wardrobe of her mother, her grandmother, and even past generations. And then playing around with those, with those clothes. So there was a sense of playfulness as well. different from what I've done in the past and especially compared to last the last summer collection um, which obviously felt very couture in its aesthetic but I think all the couture elements were there in this collection but they were just taken down and deconstructed and made more cool in some ways. I love Peter Copping and I love his feminine sensibility. Um, I, I surprised myself because I nailed the inspiration on its head. I was like, it kind of looks like a little girl dressing up in grandma's old lingerie and that's what I read today. That's exactly what it was. It was just there's a hundred pieces um, that go to make that coat, coat up. So it was quite a feat uh, for the atelier. Dusty roses and the plums were very, very important, and, and that almost gave a sense of nostalgia. And uh, it was some of them were very much like those 40 colours. And then there was a print that felt a little bit like an old tea dress that um, the girl's grandmother could have worn. It was always contrasted with black um, and and the white, which was seen in the tweeds. And uh, the dark chocolate brown was a new colour for us as well. Vintage feminine feel, um, very, very pretty, beautiful fabrics. Um, he has a very um, delicate sense of color. I mean, I think he knows exactly who his customer is. I thought it was interesting to just c combine the two elements and then um, it was just the, it, it just the way it was worn it just gave us a sense of uh, undo and um, I think it, it created a nice spirit. I think he's a real talent and women just can't resist his clothes.
And I think there was uh, definitely a basis of in French French fashion, and uh, the tweed suit, for example, is a staple French French garment. very much present but it was probably maybe just deconstructed and, and not so premium first degree. Mm -hmm.